You've got somewhere to go where you don't feel like you're being watched or you don't feel like you're being judged. It's kind of like your safe place. It's like, a, it's magic. It is, it is. I feel like it, it did calm me down because I had people to talk to about my problems and I didn't bottle it up as much. I didn't feel like an alien anymore. Having that kind of like community to talk about problems and stuff, instead of talking to my close friends who had no idea what trauma I faced and stuff, I could just talk to these new friends of mine and they literally just said to me, oh, we completely understand, yeah. Having that little tight-knit gang and it was like, I didn't have to like put up my guard and I didn't have to like be telling jokes constantly and if I wanted to cry in front of another 14-year-old, I could do that without them making fun of me or like, you know, judging me or like um, not understanding it properly. You come out realising you've got other things going on in life that you perhaps didn't even think about but were weighing you down and this place recognises that and will help you through everything. You meet other people who have got similar stories. So it wasn't necessarily what I talked about, it was just talking about it and knowing that it's a good thing to talk about, it's a good thing to express your emotions. You shouldn't shut them down, you should just ride them out, you should let them be your emotions. I just feel a lot more happier knowing that like there's people there for me to talk to, that I'm not on my own. Just made me feel a bit more confident with the situation I was in different ways to cope with it, different coping strategies that I could have done. Edwards just made me able to talk to people a lot more, be a lot more open um, and it, like be able to get things off my chest a lot easier because there's lots of highs and lows of grief and they give me coping mechanisms to cope with that. I think if I hadn't have been to Edwards Trust I'd find it very hard to get through the bereavement because there's a lot of things you just play around in your head and if you don't have anyone to talk to about them, if you don't feel comfortable talking to your family, or you're just not very open like that, they'll just eat you up inside. So having Edward's trust, they just, they just help you get rid of those kind of feelings. It kind of gave me that cushion. I can process it and deal with it and talk about it and um, I kind of understand from a perspective that I, I didn't really do before. I can honestly, hand on heart, say that I wouldn't be here now. Um, Sue has honestly saved my life and I owe my life to her. And my mum is so grateful that she's still got a daughter that she would not have had without Edward's trust and without Sue.